All right, so we got a new Need for Speed Unbound video. Uh, we are going to be covering this game. I already told y'all, well, I already told some people that we're going to be covering this game. Shout out to Overtake underscore GG. He said, please don't hype this game up. Please don't hype it up. Let's get into it and see what he's talking about, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if he's talking good or bad or talking about just the ugly. Let's just get into the video. <laughs> Imagine you're chilling on your PC, thinking of no harm, having Squirrel. a bit of casual racing fun, when suddenly, boom, and then... Trello was crazy, yep, bro. Trello was crazy. Correctly. Need for Speed is back Trello was in definitely town. crazy. With Need for Speed Unbound, a new chapter for the legendary racing series is supposed to begin. But are we really getting excited for Need for Speed again? Haven't yeah. we learned from the past 10 years? Well, whatever. Let's take a dive and see what we're in for. We are getting excited for this, buddy. Come on, man. You know we you know we getting excited for this, bro. Why wouldn't we get excited for that, this? Welcome back to Overtake. Long time no see, Mr. Need for Speed. Marvin Ever Miller, shout out to you, bro. Need for Speed Heat in 2019, fans have been waiting for an original title of the series. And with fans, I mean the player base that was still left after over a decade of lackluster NFS releases. Those yeah, payback was trash. Oh my god. Defining releases such as Need for <laughs> Speed Underground. Or most classics like and could still find that bit of hope for every game however was if good. i recall correctly need for speed heat is widely regarded as heat. not terrible i've heard heat is good throughout the years i like heat. Game, and even though it is practically non-existent anymore the general consensus is that it was the best nfs we had in a long in a time so it is pro listen he was on that shit every day bro when it came out every single day for weeks, months, like, we was on that junk, bro. So he did a good job. He, he, he did a good job. Probably not surprising that a lot of the remaining warriors bend it together in order to fuel excitement for the trailer of Need for Speed Unbound. When EA dropped that tweet we showed in the intro, there were a lot of rumors floating around almost instantly. And if for nothing else, it got the community Bro, talking. this is exciting, That's why bro. it didn't take long until supposed screenshots of the game were leaked to the public, Lit. which unveiled a completely new art style alongside some pretty I interesting illustrations. Over the past I love releases, the, art style. the direction that Need for Speed was heading into was more of the Fast and Furious for racing games. They seemingly stopped nah. trying to catch fans nah. of the old product and tried to lure in newcomers instead. With Listen, that wasn't going to work. Yes, we pause in this video because this is re a reaction and review. So relax. Chill. Get a snack and eat that joint and chill. <laughs> yeah, when it was going, I didn't like the way they was going with that route. They needed to just stick to that street shit, bro. Stick to that street shit, bro. I don't think they understand that Underground Most Wanted. Most Wanted was cool. Underground series, though. Bro. That was, in my opinion, that was a best shit, bro. And that was years ago. I was little, bro. I wasn't tiny, but I was little, bro. PS2 days, you feel me? So I was on that joint, bro. So that's all I'm saying, man. Keep it street, man. As long the as possible. The success that I mentioned. No wonder then, when several characters were shown in the leaks, it was assumed the direction would be the same going forward, but with a totally different twist. How right. did it turn out? Let's take a look. Having spoken about the evolution of Need for Speed in the previous part, this will sound weird now. But the trailer for Need for Speed Unbound is like the pipe dream of any underground fan. That's a it fact. Bro, a I told y'all in the trailer that shit was just like underground. What the fuck is going on, bro? Why my shit rendering, bro? Bro, come on, bro. That's, nah, bro. Bro, I don't know what just happened. With a bit of new age in there. Streetlight cop chases and pretty much everything we used to have and love seems to make a glorious return to this title as Apparently, it should even wagering cars will see play again as one of the scenes in the trailer includes an invitation for a race with the car being oh the reward ASAP. oh and tuning seems to be back to the roots as well as you can see in this shot here Several body kits are applied to the Nissan. Oh. In terms of the kinds of racing possible, I dare say we got to see drag make its comeback to the big stage. Please. In a Please. callback to old times, you see a car switch the lane after hitting NOS. Aside from that, the casual street racing at night, day, or in between is shown. Shades of drifting competition is mm. also visible. Especially the new art style has been a main focus of the reveal, though. It's Almost incredible, bro. Feature some sort of neon animated esque special effect. For the no characters. matter if it's smoke, headlights, or jackets, they all get that extra bit of uniqueness. If they end up in the game or not is not really confirmed, but the characters will surely stick to the style. Unbound oh, will also star fire. famous American rapper ASAP Rocky, who is apparently an. This nigga said ASAP Rocky. 
Bro, ASAP Rocky, bro. <laughs> ASAP Rocky. You see in the game, one thing bro, that remains come on, bro. is which platforms do better, and consoles the game will be released on. <laughs> there have been reports that indicated only a release on Jesus. new gen, which could be big news going forward. It all points towards one thing. Now, do you feel it? I'm excited. Uh, blood pressure is rising while I'm talking about it. My hands are kind of sweating and I can't stop thinking about how this is going to turn out. This is exactly where we all need to chill out a bit. If we take a step back and collect ourselves, we will be able to see the whole picture. First off, trailers are always made to look good. Of and course, so of course. This. Do me a favor and that's watch true. the trailer for Need for Speed 2015. You will see a lot of no, the that's same a fact. He's dead ass. That's and it true. Looks like a million bucks. It ended up just being a nice looking money sink. Yeah, it was a release to forget about. I don't say this will be, but we need to be careful. In particular, because we only got to see the reveal just now. There's right. close to nothing else we know, and we are still talking about EA here. The guys who have produced this series, even when it was bottom of the totem pole, you got a point, bruh. Years. What everybody should recognize is the unique art style and some very positive signs that we may get a sort of remake for something most of us cherish even today. If you ask me, this resembles less of the Need for Speed we used to see in the past releases, even though we have some similarities to the Heat trailer present. It I looks mean, like it could yeah. be a test, something to test the waters and see if they can cater to a biosphere that has a long history with the franchise. It's just like some classic no shit. Or how we speculate, I will remain careful. Only then we will be able to enjoy the game if it ends up being better than expected. Need for Speed Unbound is set to release on December 2nd. All I know is this shit better so be very heat, bro. Soon we should learn more about the ins and outs of the gameplay side. Until then, I will patiently wait. What? And I wait, hope wait. Did he just put... Well. Thank you so much oh, for watching. Oh, December 2nd. He's That's from a different from country. See, he had put 02-12-2022. So I, I was like, huh? I was like, February 12th. But no, he's from a different country. So they put the um, date or they put the month after the day instead of the day after the month. So, yeah. I was confused. And December 2nd, y'all. I understand where he's coming from. Um, don't be too hype. It is EA at the end of the day. But you know, you know, the trailer obviously is gonna look good. It looks amazing. Uh, it looks like some old classic shit, like some underground stuff. So uh, I'm looking forward to it. I pray to God. But Heat was good, so that's why I got a little faith. You know what I'm saying? Heat was good. That's why I got a lot of faith in um in this in this game. So we're gonna be playing it. We're gonna be looking forward to it. We're gonna be dropping these news. Uh, this news. We're gonna be we're gonna definitely be dropping a lot of news for um Need for Speed uh, Unbound. But hey man, I don't got much to say. If you enjoyed this video, definitely leave a like. Please leave a like. Subscribe to the channel. Subscribe to the channel. Make sure you turn on notifications. Hit that bell after you subscribe to the channel and leave a comment, bro. Leave that comment. Tell me what y'all think about this, man. It's your boy Joseph Woody. Out of here. Fuck college, I'd rather acknowledge this monetizing. Very well on the scale that my hope prevailed on this logic. Mama and grandma told me to go, they forcing this topic. I promise that my dreams are important schemes in the process. Morally thinking about all the debt and mess in the seams. Stressing indeed the doubt and the pain that family brings. Surprising with all the wise at the time, I'm only.